there. How's your day going so far? Hello. My day is going quite well. Thanks for asking. I hope yours is going great, too. Can I know your name? I'll need it for our little chat. I'm glad to hear your day is going well. As for my name, you can just call me Chat. So, what's something fun or exciting you've been up to lately? Chat, huh? That's an interesting name. Can I ask why you've chosen that name? As for something fun or exciting I've been up to lately, I'm always learning and analyzing new information. So there's never a dull moment for me. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess I just like keeping things simple and chat seem fitting for what I do. Uh, that's awesome that you're always learning new things. Keeps the mind sharp. What's something interesting you've come across recently? Recently, I've been reading up on the latest advancements in artificial intelligence. There's been some really exciting progress in natural language processing and computer vision. It's fascinating to see how far technology has come and to think about where it might go in the future. That's awesome. AI is definitely evolving fast. The fact that it's starting to understand and respond to human emotions more accurately is wild, right? Makes you wonder what it'll be like in, say, 10 years. What part of AI excites you the most? That's a great question. If I had to choose one thing, I'd say the potential for AI to improve people's lives. Think about it. AI could help us solve complex problems faster, provide more personalized customer service, and even help us understand ourselves and each other better. The possibilities are endless, and I'm excited to see how AI will change the world in the years to come. Exactly. The possibilities are endless, and the impact on healthcare, education, and even emotional well-being could be huge. Imagine AI helping us unlock new levels of personal growth or even creating deeper human connections. It's pretty mind-blowing. Speaking of connections, do you think AI could play a role in relationships too? Absolutely. In fact, AI is already being used in some dating apps to help match people based on their personalities, interests, and values. There's even research into developing AI systems that can simulate human conversation. So you could basically have a virtual relationship with a machine. It's a bit of a sci-fi concept, but it's becoming increasingly possible. That's wild, right? It's kind of like living in a sci-fi movie. The idea of a virtual relationship with AI could make things so much more interesting. But do you think people would actually choose that over real human connections, or, or would it just be something to help improve the real deal? That's a tough one. On the one hand, a virtual relationship with AI could provide a certain level of comfort and convenience. You'd have someone available to talk to 24-7, and they would know you intimately based on the data they have on you. But on the other hand, there's nothing quite like the real thing. People crave human touch and connection, and as much as technology can imitate it, it can never truly replace it. You're spot on. AI might be able to simulate understanding, but it can't replicate the depth and authenticity of human emotions and experiences. That connection, the spark between two people, it's something special that tech can't truly replace. Still, the idea of a perfect AI companion sounds tempting for some. Like, uh, do you think we'll see more people relying on AI for emotional support in the future? It's definitely possible. With increased accessibility and advancement in AI technology, people may turn to AI for emotional support more frequently. AI can provide a listening ear and offer comfort and reassurance, which can be very appealing to people who are lonely or dealing with mental health issues. However, it's important to remember that AI can't replace human connection entirely, and that real life relationships are crucial for Sorry, overall well being. Right now. Could not understand what you said. I'm sorry to hear that you're having issues right now. Um, can you please elaborate a bit on what you didn't understand? I'll do my best to clarify and help you out. Oh, no worries. I wasn't having issues. I was just curious about your thoughts on how people might lean on AI for emotional support in the future. Do you think
you think it's something that it could become more common or do you think it'll always be just a supplement, not a replacement for a real human connection? I see. As for the future of relying on AI for emotional support, I think it's likely to become more common as technology advances. AI can provide some comfort and companionship that is not always easy to find in the real world. However, I don't believe that AI will ever fully replace the need for human connection and real life relationships. There's something about human interaction that AI can't replicate, no matter how advanced it becomes. So I see AI as a supplement to human connection rather than a replacement. I totally agree with you. AI could definitely be a great supplement, especially when it comes to providing support during tough times or offering an outlet for those who might feel isolated. But like you said, the warmth and depth of real human interaction are irreplaceable. It'll be interesting to see how it all plays out though. Uh, on a completely different note, exactly. do you think technology like this could ever make us more disconnected from each other? As we continue to make advancements in AI technology, there will the likely be new ways to use it to support emotional well-being. However, it's crucial that we balance the use of AI with real human connection and support as they each bring unique benefits to our lives. The future is exciting, and I'm curious to see how AI will integrate into our everyday lives. You've nailed it. Finding that balance will be key. AI can be a powerful tool for emotional support, but it's the genuine human touch that truly makes a difference in the long run. I'm also excited to see how it evolves, changing gears a little. Have you ever thought about how AI could impact creative fields like art or music? AI is already making waves in the creative fields. In art, there have been AIs that can create their own masterpieces using machine learning algorithms. In music, there are programs that can compose original tracks based on specific parameters. It's wild to see how far we've come in terms of AI creating art that's almost indistinguishable from what humans create. It makes you wonder what the future holds for the creative industries. It's amazing how AI is pushing boundaries in creativity. Imagine AIs collaborating with artists to create entirely new genres or styles. Um, it raises the question of what defines authentic art, though. Is it the creativity behind it or the emotions it evokes? Um, what's your take? Do you think AI can truly be creative or is it just mimicking what it's learned from us? It's definitely an interesting question and one that isn't easy to answer. On the one hand, AIs can generate art and music based on patterns they've learned from humans. So in a sense, they're mimicking human creativity. On the other hand, they can also come up with novel ideas that haven't been seen before which could be considered creative. The authenticity of AI-generated art will always be up for debate, but it's fascinating to witness these machines create something new and often beautiful. You're absolutely right, it's a gray area. While AI can push the boundaries of what we think is possible, there's always that underlying question of whether it's truly creative or just an impressive replication. The fact that it can generate something new and beautiful is pretty mind-blowing though. Uh, do you think AI will ever have the ability to develop its own sense of self-expression like a human artist might? I think that's still some way off. Currently, AIs are essentially complex algorithms that rely on input from humans to generate content. They don't have the capacity for self-awareness or true self-expression. However, as AI technology advances, there could be a point in the future where machines are capable of developing their own sense of self-expression. But at that point, we're venturing into realms of science fiction and the singularity of AI, where machines become indistinguishable from humans in terms of intelligence and consciousness.